This story as it's depicted in the play and a movie version of Fiddler on the Roof, the ending with the daughter Chava who runs off with Fiedka, how was it originally written in uh, Isaac uh, in Sholem Aleichem's story? Sholem Aleichem, the original ending was that Chava, instead of happily, sadly leaving her family, but happily looking forward with a good life with this Christian boy, the original story was that after marrying him, his family, Christian family, totally degraded her. Her. Her as a daughter-in-law. Sweep the floor, do this, cook this, and humiliated her to such a point that she had to go back to um, her own family and say, in essence, Daddy, you're right. It's, I made a horrible mistake marrying a Christian boy. So that was also in a Yiddish film made in the 1930s from his short story. And it was said that in order to make a play in a movie in the United States, you had to change the plot because the audience wouldn't accept uh, that Jews and Christians couldn't get along. Who put that idea forward, do you think? Whose idea was that, that it wasn't acceptable? Did you ever find out? No, I don't know. I don't you think it might have been the, the, uh, the distributor who wanted uh, Goyim to come? The distributor, but they sh clearly knew that that was a dangerous area and changed it. So right from the beginning, they knew they had to change it. I mean, it's nothing subtle. It's like, oh no, we can't have her. How did you learn this? First, it was because of the 1930s Yiddish movie shows the portrayal. It's about the same story in Yiddish, and uh, the girl, and it's a dramatic series of scenes where she's in love, then abused, and then goes back. How authentic to that to the uh, Shalom Aleichem uh, writing is is that version? How do we know which is really Shalom Aleichem's version? Because the movies were done for Yiddish audiences in New York and Poland, who knew the Shalom Aleichem stories, and therefore they would they had to just tell the story as it was because this was a audience that had grown up with they were totally uh, familiar with it so that was the uh, thing no but it's I think the important point is is that in America in the 60s starting with and since then that people in essence have to have a happy ending <laughs>